the March 1 cutoff was not kind to us. So some background. We have a part-time legislature in Washington state, which means that our senators and representatives all theoretically have other jobs and they cram their work into a highly compressed period of time uh, here in the first quarter every year. In odd, numbers, odd numbered years, they do all of the legislating in about 120 days and even numbered years, it's even less, about 60 days. Because in uh, we get a new budget once every two years. Uh, so in the odd numbered years, the legislative session is longer to make uh, accommodate the budget writing process. But anyway, uh, to keep things moving forward, there are some deadlines along the way that bills have to get passed in order to um, uh, still have hope of, of um, becoming laws. These are called cutoffs because any bill that hasn't uh, passed a particular milestone by that de date is considered dead. Um, even though there are ways it can come back to life, um, more on that in a minute. So the first cutoff uh, every session is the policy committee cutoff, uh, at which point a bill must be out of the um, a policy committee of its house of origin. Um, all the bills that we had interest in uh, beat this deadline by at least a week, easy peasy. The second cutoff is the fiscal committee cutoff, at which point a bill must be out of the fiscal committee of its house of origin. And that was on March 1st, <laughs> and none of our bills made it past that point. Now, one of our three bills, we have three, one of them doesn't have any fiscal impact, so um, it got to skip that step, so presumably it's still right on track. Both of our other two priorities have some hope because they um, could get attached to the budget as a proviso, uh, and in relative terms, they're both pretty small, so uh, chances are better for them than for bigger ticket items. The proviso process is a little more mysterious, uh, less transparent, and since we're new at this, we have less ability to impact it. Uh, but if you'd like to help, you can um, email Michaela Chandler, our policy and advo advocacy coordinator. She's at M Chan, M-C-H-A-N, at skookumkids.org. She'll get you squared away explain to you how to help advocate for these priorities and, and who to reach out to.